I'm going to talk about the best job opportunity of 2021 where no coding knowledge is required, no technical background is required. I'll talk about this opportunity in detail. I'll talk about that, that how it's going to go in the next five years and how you can become the part of this and multifold your salary. Because this industry is not saturated. So stay till the end of the video because I'm going to give you some invaluable information and there are bonuses worth rupees 1500. I'll tell you the way you can get them. Okay, so let's talk about the best job opportunity in 2021 and 2022. You know that already the data science industry is something which is growing like anything and that's where the opportunity lies. But I know the very first thing that comes into your mind that you would be needing some technical knowledge for the same. Trust me, you won't. The things that I'm going to talk about will shock you and you will prefer to go into this and will multifold your salary into that also. Let's talk about that what we are going to cover into this small clip. So the very first thing we'll talk about what data science is all about. I know that there are a lot of myths in our mind who are actually not from this industry at all. And what are the tools and components of data science? Again, from the non-coding background perspective, I'm going to talk about all these. And what is business intelligence, which is a part of a data science industry. And we're going to see the market size of the business intelligence. Because let me tell you one thing. I also am from a non-technical background. I'm an MBA finance. And how I came into this, I'm going to talk about that. And how I multifold my earning through this. We'll also talk about the most popular tools that we should consider going into if you want to build your career around business intelligence. And we're going to see the job opportunities as well as the starting salary as well as the average salary that you can expect when you want to come into the business intelligence. Now, the very important thing, my videos are for someone who is an action taker. So I always believe that someone who is watching my video will definitely take an action. And if you do, then just write I C I W into the comment section, which means I can and I will just write I C I W. I'm giving you three seconds right now. One, two, three. Thank you. Okay. Now let's start. The very first question comes in. What is data science? Very simple words. Data science help in processing the huge amount of data and will help us solving a business problem. That's it. Processing the huge amount of data and solving a business problem. That's what a data science is all about. Now, this is a huge industry. It has a huge ecosystem. Let's talk about those components now. But again, keep in mind that we are going to talk about from a non-technical background. So it is definitely for you to have an interest in. So the very first thing, these are the components which comes into the ecosystem of the data science. Now, the very first thing, majorly the components that you see are catering to some technical knowledge. Like if we talk about the machine learning, the deep learning, like the scientific method, the mathematical operations that we need to do, statistical knowledge is required, some deep statistical knowledge is required, advanced computing and all such things are the part of the data science but you may or can also notice one thing which actually brings the opportunity on your plate and that is data visualization think about it a person who is a data scientist is actually using the data science to process the entire data applying machine learning and deep learning around that building the model and everything but ultimately the data needs to be present in front of the stakeholder the end user so that they can make the informed decision and they are not from the technical background ultimately it has to be served in a way then they will be able to understand it completely and that's where the data visualization comes in and that's where again no coding knowledge is required now where this data visualization you can do the point is that you should get into the BI technology. Business intelligence is something that caters this visualization part. And that is what a part of the entire data science ecosystem. Now, what do you mean by business intelligence? Let me tell you the entire flow of the same. 
and again no coding knowledge required and again also the competition into this is very less i'm going to talk about the market size also in a minute first let's talk about the entire flow in the bi technology here what you do you actually get the data you clean up the data then you load it into the bi tool this is known as an etl process once it has been loaded we build a model around it then we write some functions so that we can get some insights and finally we create a report which can be shared with the end user so they can make the informed decision and based on that a problem of the business can be solved so that is the entire flow of a business intelligence technology which is a bi technology now the point is the competition into the bi is very less because only the handful of people know such technology and that's where the opportunity lies also the next question comes into our mind is about the market size the market size was in 2020 was around 23 billion dollar itself only for the bi tools i'm talking about not the entire data science industry it is just the bi tool and it is expected to increase to 33 billion by 2025 so there is a huge opportunity lies for you if you believe that you are stuck in your job if you believe that no recognition is there for the for the kind of process for the kind of contribution that you are doing for the organization that you should look for this amazing opportunity also the next question comes in our mind is that what kind of tools are available in the bi technology what we should go for let me help you that also look at this entire slide many tools are available many tools are available but the most popular tool that you can see in this one is power bi which is by microsoft why it is popular that's also we need to understand number 1 that it is a very much cheap tool almost any organization can afford it whether it is a micro one or a macro one also power bi it's upgrading itself every month the team of power bi they are upgrading this program like anything that is again another reason that power bi is so much popular in the market and in fact it's not only i am telling you this but there has been the survey which has been done by gartner and let me show you the comparison power bi came into the market in year 2015 and look at the position of this power bi over here it is way below the other power bi uh, the other uh, bi tools in the market you can see tableau is at number 1 but over the years if you see every year gartner did the survey and now you can see in 2021 it is at the very top the reason i have already told you it's a very cheap tool and also it keeps on upgrading every month and it's so amazing to see the kind of capabilities this tool has that's the reason this tool is at number 1 and again let me remind you one thing it do not require any technical knowledge and the demand for the same is very high in the market and the supply is very low that's where the opportunity is now you know that bi the power bi is the most popular tool let's talk about if you get into this tool how much salary you can expect the very first thing if you get into the tool and if you are a fresher in terms of the b you do not have any bi experience into the market then you can expect 6 lakh per annum salary in rupees in the indian market because that's what the starting salary i have seen my students my followers the people whom i contacted so far they came back to me and said that okay this much of the salary that they are getting and that's the average salary average starting salary i can see you can also go on to various job portals in fact the glassdoor.com you can also go and other websites and you can see what is the starting salary that companies are paying this is what you will find 6 lakh per annum on the other hand if you have an experience of around 2 to 3 years into this technology you can earn up to 12 to between 12 to 18 lakh per annum and it can actually go up to 60 to 70 lakhs per annum once you have a huge amount of experience with you and also depends in the industry that you are going into and also the company that you are going into if you have a finance background if you have a knowledge into finance then you can expect the salary on a higher end 
Now, this was all about the salary. This was the opportunity. Now, I would like to give an opportunity from my side to you. If you think that, okay, this is the opportunity that you can grab into the market, you should go into it. Then, the amazing part is that I am coming up with a free masterclass where I'm going to talk about this tool in detail, where I'm going to talk about that how Power BI is solving real-time business problem. The link for the same is given in the description. This is absolutely free. I'm not going to charge anything from you. Just spare one hour and you will get in-depth knowledge that how without any technical background, you can actually grow into this industry. You can part, become the part of this huge industry. And let's see what all we are going to cover into this one hour webinar is that first we'll talk about the big problem and the solution. Then we're going to talk about that where we found the need of having a BI tool into the market and how Power BI came into the picture and how it evolved over years. And also I'm going to talk about five case studies and I'm going to show five different dashboards which has been created through Power BI and how they're solving real time business problems. And at the end, I'm also going to talk about that how Power BI will benefit you. And it's not just that, that this amazing masterclass is going to be free for you, but also I'm going to give bonuses worth rupees 1500 absolutely free if you join the masterclass and be with me till the end. So I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you got the opportunity that I'm talking about. I'm really excited to see you in the webinar. And also, if you do not grab the opportunity right now, trust me, you're going to regret later because peers of yours will definitely choose this technology because it do not require any technical background and the competition is very, very, very less. I hope I'm going to see you into the webinar. The link is below. Just go there and sign up. And if you like this video, just give me a thumbs up so that I can come up with such amazing stuff. Thank you so much.